Hello and welcome to Sue Feeling Designs. Today's project is incorporating shells and stones into the resin art. I've been asked by a few people what they could do with their shells other than just doing regular beach art and I've had these shells in my um, stash of products for a long time. I was actually given these quite a few years ago when I was working on some other projects and I didn't really know what I was going to do with them so it's given me an opportunity to actually use these in this project. Now this particular piece is going to go into uh, an exhibition next week which is called Elements of Nature so it's after this I should be using shells in this project. So what I've done here is used using a small amount of India ink on the plate um, I'm just applying it to the shells with a touch of water so that it runs into the creases and is not too thick on each of the shells. And I'm using two colours. I'm using a turquoise blue and a green. And all I'm going to do is just coat each one uh, with uh, quite a bit of the ink and then just leave them to dry. So once dry, it's now on to the resin portion. Now I left those shells to dry overnight just to make sure that there was no water left in there because as you know, water and resin doesn't mix. So what I'm done here, I'm using a little bit of Arty Sue Sparkle White just to give the white um, background a bit of sparkle. And I'm not using any other white in this, it's just other than the boards being painted white. And all I was doing there was just wiping the glove so that I can pick up my, my heat gun without getting resin all over the handle. Next I'm just going to position the shells across the centre of the board. So I've coated these in a little bit of clear resin making sure that the shells are covered um, all over the insides and out so that they've got a nice glossy shine and also so that there's a good bond to the board with the the resin and I'm just tweaking it now just so that I get the look that I'm after. Next I've done the same thing with these white stones I've just coated them in a little bit of clear resin and I'm now just sprinkling them around the board um, quite random I'm not actually uh, placing them anywhere just letting them drop and um, wherever they fall and I've got two sizes of stones here which I just bought from the local uh, craft store and again there's no actual pattern I've just started with the the larger stones closer to the center and then just using the smaller stones um, out towards the edge next I've just mixed a similar color to the shells I'm using resin art luster pigments by colour art and this colour is aquamarine and I'm also using some turquoise India ink which I already have uh, in my collection of um, products. Again as always I will list all the products in the description below and all I'm going to do here now is just using my heat gun I'm just warming the edges of the the colour resin because I want that to bleed into the white so that you sort of get like ripples happening and by warming that the resin will start to move slightly and as you can see it's actually drifted out to the edges quite nicely As always, I hope you enjoyed this quick video. If you'd like to see more videos like this, then please subscribe to my channel or better still go and browse my other videos. I have plenty of eyes to keep you inspired. So until next time, bye for now.